So let's talk music, my brother. Talk it, brother. So we understand the Def Jam deal came third. We'll get to that. So you got signed three times, well, two times before. Yes, sir. So let's talk about your first record deal. First record deal, 15 years old. I had a song called We'll Destroy. You know what I'm saying? And shout out to my bro, just came home. David Miles, love this to death. Mm -hmm. Did 20 years in the feds, you feel me? I was, I was like 15 when I made a song. Talking about a situation that he went through with one of his pockets hitting him for like a million dollars. You feel me? Wow. Street, real street business, though. Everybody know that's where I really started from, from that song. So when that happened, the song was just buzzing in the city. And just Stone heard about it. She got involved with the song. But during the time, though, she didn't even know she was saving my life. My man getting in trouble. I was, running, I was living in Atlanta way back when I was a young boy, going yeah. to Jazzy T's. Oh, wow. I'm talking about killing it. Oh, if any remember way back, mm. me and my man should run around here with the Hummers with 26s and shit way back then. I'm talking about spinning hella racks in the Crazy. club, going insane. I, was, I remember seeing Gucci Man in them before that wow. was even anything. Jeezy, all that before anything like that. We going to the Gentleman Club, going to the bounce, rocking the bounce out here. I used to perform at the bounce. If you, you might not even know, you gotta be a real ATL a minute ago. to know about the bounce. You feel me? Where yeah. you perform at the bounce, that shit Booing you off the stage. Mm -hmm. Like, so we was down here in Atlanta cutting a food. So, yeah, I made that song about my man's situation. She heard the record, got involved with it. She And back at that time, it wasn't no internet, none of that. Yeah. So it was word of mouth. She could run up to anybody and say, hey, look, I got a little artist. I want to boom. So she just introduced me to the right people. Man, they took me in them rooms, and boy, it was on. Sylvia Rome. Sylvia Rome. As soon as I walk in the room, she's like, you cute. I'm young as hell. Yeah, yeah. Got my little hat to the back. You feel yeah, yeah. I'm going to do my she like, let me hear what you got. They start playing my in there. But at the time, I if you want to die, then talk the noise. So I'm just talk the noise. Find the you born to ride, then call you boy. <laughs> call you boy. Find <laughs> you love and that we will destroy. Listen, though, I'm yeah. 15 sounding like that. Ooh, yeah, we 15. Yeah. So she like, oh, hell yeah. Like, whatever we got to do, let's do this deal now. So they instantly, droop, droop, yeah. that. Oh, what company was that with? Electra. Way back. Remember with yeah. Fabulous, okay. Missy Elliott? Okay. Way back. So I signed with them. The shit went sour because Electra had a merger with Universal. That's why Universal got up all the labels. I remember that. And so I got caught up in the merger, and they, didn't have, they hadn't put no money into my project. They gave me like a $25,000 advance. Mm -hmm. You feel me? They was finna move me to Atlanta. Had me, man, I'm talking, I had flew to Florida to meet with cash money. They were trying to put me. At the time, they tried to break you be with a click. Okay. Like, you got to be with... Cash money, or you gotta be with you feel me? So I'm, I'm so they trying to find who I'm gonna be I'm with. Label, so they yeah. was doing little things like that for me, trying to get me locked in. But they end up having a merger, so through the merger, I end up getting dropped from that joint. So I ain't never had did a record and then putting that now. I'm just young, merger happened, I got dropped. You feel me? So that's how it went. 25,000. 25,000 and a meet Sylvia Roll. I went to Missy Elliott birthday party, waste liquor all over, ah, Adidas outfit. Wait a minute, hold yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, we've cut up. 15, 16 years Yeah, bro, they get me in there. For sure, all over her little Adidas outfit. Wait, they wait, mad bro. as hell. You gotta <laughs> tell me that mad story. Mad as hell. Bro, <laughs> bro we in New York because yeah. at this time, you feel I'm with Angie Stone, mm -hmm. so they taking me everywhere now because we got the deal. It's yeah, done. Yeah. So at this time, it's celebrity status. Angie Stone, we red carpet here and there, everywhere. You Angie Stone artist. Oh, come on, man. You yeah, know how this yeah, is yeah. everywhere we go. So we moving like this. So when she going to these events to meet whoever, whatever, you know, we go to Missy party and invite Angie. You know, she taking me. I'm the new signee. So Sylvia, them see me in there. You know that when so Sylvia, all them I'm sitting around. The VIP got everybody in there. Mm. So Missy in there, they sitting beside each other. Now come in that young, I'm supposed to be drinking. I'm already feeling now. <laughs> I'm feeling good as hell. They try to introduce me to her. She get up, man. I done, blew, I done hit somebody cup. Man, that's oh, you know, it's one of them too. One of them. Oh, yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's how. That's how I met Missy Ellis. What is Everybody Miss, put my arm around me like this little rule. I'm like, hey, I'm just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The whole time. What does Missy's face look like when you but spill? Mad as hell, bro. She was mad. It was no smile. She was wiping that <laughs> up and down. You know how you looking at <laughs> while you cleaning yourself? I can't believe I can't, this. Yeah, bro. Back when she had the Adidas <laughs> on with the hat. The whole Adidas run. Shouts out, Missy Shout Ellis. Missy, man. man. Damn, story. I'm sorry too, Missy. That's Phil. a dope story. Man. I ain't need to <laughs> do that. Hey, brother, why? The about that night right there, my man Devin the Dude, bro. Shouts out Devin. He was in the club that night. I never forget Devin the Dude in the club that night. I didn't know who he was though. You feel me? Mm. That blew my mind. Like ain't no Devin the Dude. I was in that going crazy. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh shit. 
thing to do. I was all up in the VIP. He was just on the side smoking weed, smoking. Yeah. Weed. And it was real to me then. Yeah. I was like, he really, well, he really that he like smoking yeah. weed, cool as a bitch. Yeah. That was just one of those legendary times. Shout out, shout hey, out. you for letting me relive Love, that there real man. quick. <laughs> hey man, that's a legendary story. Anybody yeah. get close enough to Missy Elliott to to spill liquor on her Adidas outfit? Bruh. Everybody in the VIP. <laughs> I'm f Sylvia Roth, everybody. Boy, I'm talking about f But Sylvia Roth get fucked up. Oh. She get fucked up. Oh, yeah, she party. Why? She gets fucked. She get fucked up. She man. <laughs> man, she took me a little. Yo, that night, that, I, I, I can go. That night was amazing. That yeah. was amazing. She took me to the limousine with her. Talking about like old school back in the day. She should we jump in the limo. Yeah. Like, we in the car. She called Tata, Jay Z partner. Yeah. Trying to get him to manage me and everything. And they're telling him how she about to really put a lot of focus on me. I'm mm. gonna be, I'm bro, word up. I go to the when Jay Z, what I forgot the club Jay Z had. What is it? 4040. I went over there wow. to meet Tata. You feel me? We all chopping it up. You feel me? I brought him brands that so many legendary ones. Jay That's Brown. Crazy. You feel me? He's like a big fish, a yeah. big dog. He done took me all around, ride me around everywhere. I, that's when I was young, but you know, I never got to do no. Yeah. I, that's my family on, a, on some law. Like, yeah. We never got a chance to really work, but we was working. They that's was crazy. really believing in that. 